Okay, now it's time to create our new class called session, which will be basically handling all session variables and so on. So, new file inside of the classes called session.php. Inside of this file, open in PHP tag, class session, open in curly brace and closing right at the end. Then um, we're going to create the first public static function so that we have access to this function whenever we want without instantiating the class itself, which will be called set item. As you may remember, we've been calling this method already. Uh, we will be passing ID and we will also be passing quantity, which will default to one. Now, session basket with the ID. Uh, with the index of the ID and quantity and we will assign the quantity to it so basically we're creating a session called basket with the ID of the specific product and its quantity that's all inside of the set item method next method will be called public static again function remove item and we will be passing ID as well and quantity, which by default will equal to null. So we don't have to basically pass the second parameter. Same as here, because obviously by default it's going to be one. Okay, so if quantity doesn't equal null and quantity is less than our session basket ID quantity which has been created earlier if we're removing an item we obviously uh, we obviously know that this item has been created earlier uh, then we want to session uh, basket we basically want to uh, deduct quantity from the current quantity in the basket so our current quantity and and we actually let's copy this rather than typing the whole thing again equals again quantity minus the quantity passed to this specific function method okay then semicolon right at the end if then else, if it's null, then obviously just pass the ID. In which case, what we want to do, if we paste the, the entire thing without the quantity, and we set this to null, which will basically uh, set the entire uh, basket together with the ID of the product to null. And then we want to unset this specific session as well. In other words, we want to remove it. Okay, so that uh, that's these two methods. So we can close this session file and we can move to the next video.